Hello and welcome back to ba Baldur's Gate. Um, do we have a short rest? No, we don't. We just we did, we just short rested. If you missed a couple episodes, I swapped my cleric for a rogue and I swapped a Styrian out for Karlak. Um, this is going to be our party for the game. By the gods, you're a sweet sight. We also just killed Are a bunch of gnolls. Are still alive out there? Uh, no, it's a grim sight. This whole journey's been one grim sight after another. Knolls, goblins, drow. Oh my. Risen Road's more dangerous than ever. You're the first friendly face we've seen since Eltergard. Eltergard's a long way from here. Where are you hiding? Where are you heading? We're bound for Baldur's Gate. Got some cargo to deliver. But we've a stop to make along the way. Everyone's heading to Baldur's Gate. Uh, where's that? Joaquin's Rest. It's just up the road. I'd be enjoying a mug of ale right now if those beasts hadn't jumped us. Listen, you look like you know how to handle yourself. You should meet my associates. We've got our own drinking spot by the tavern. Invitation only. Nice. Tell the fellow on the door. Little Serpent, Long Shadow. He'll take good care of you. Cool. It's coin. Joaquin's rest has been burned to the ground. Damn it. Nowhere safe anymore. Doesn't change the plan though. We'll head over there and check for survivors. Um what's in the chest? Your cargo? Aye. The whole reason we're in this mess. Trinkets for some rich tosser in Baldur's Gate. He gets his shiny baubles. We get a handful of terenths. Nice. Saved fail history. Oh, well. A lot of people died for those baubles. Rich men place more value on wine and fine clothes than on the lives of folks like me. True. It's a pretty bit of frippery that'll sit on a mantle gathering dust. But the pay for delivering it makes the risk worthwhile. Hmm, how much is that? Whatever your cargo is, I'll take it as payment. No, I'm not going to do that. But I might steal it. I won't take it forcibly, but I might take it shrewdly and, you know, with a bit of guile. Is that it right there? They are looking at it. That might be well, my luck. It's our lucky day after all. I don't feel lucky. The rest of our crew's half digested and you're still alive. That's lucky. Something's on my mind. I'll be glad when we're out of this bloody What's your cave. deal? Who was it that told, said that, uh, they should, we should just, you know, we should abandon whoever's trying to help us fight the gnolls. Who's fighting the gnolls? Who cares? Now, I do know of a very Larian soft way of doing this, uh, doing this without arising much suspicion is what you do. Is you go over here and you talk to Ollie. I'll be glad when we're out of this bloody cave. And you, uh... Oh, never mind. I'll be glad when we're out of this. Okay, well, I guess that's not gonna work. Yeah, someone out there knew knows what I was gonna do. You can um. It's our lucky day after all. You can you can talk to uh someone and then have someone else while their head is turned do you know many things. Like a steal from a oh a rotten lemon. Oh. You know what they say, when life gives you rotten lemons, well, you're just shit out of luck, aren't you? This is a good voice. You're welcome. Okay, what do we got? We got some rags, road dust, gray clothes, a backpack. Ooh, lots of stuff. Good, good things here. What, what? Uh, some cups, some more potions of healing more bed rolls we definitely have things over there i want to check out those things over there excuse me Ooh, a wooden trunk oh a wooden trunk we got there lock Come pick on, it open up in it what's in it <laughs> yo lo locked chest what do we got in it 
this this is is this anything is this something no we got a potion of speed and a bronze gob uh add to wares can't wait till we find an actual what's in here store what do you mean what's in here frost kiss ale Ooh, rotten water haven heavy and cheese wheel it's a terrible thing to waste a wheel of cheese hmm. all right you know what they say a, a wheel of rotten cheese well that's just blue cheese watch how you go oh poison mine huh Okay, let's go ahead and disarm that. Can't reach. Okay. Don't jump over here, please. I'm gonna need a hefty amount of goidance for this. Is that 20? Critical success. Nice. Wait, rotten mushroom? Uh. What we got here? Nice. 23. I like I like making my checks. Reasons grasp. Ever val vigilant when the wearer, wearer chooses to end the rage, they gain 15 temporary hit points. Well, that seems like an obvious choice for uh, Karlak. Seems a good one. Hmm. Hmm. Boy, that seems to be a chest. Oh, am I going to be prone and take one damage? Ouch. Oh, I guess I could have led them, them gnolls over here, huh? Look, look at all the traps. Look at all the traps. There's a giant ass boulder and crates and all kinds of stuff this would have been uh like the perfect place to set up some you know something oh no 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 oh. perception failed huh hate to think of what i just failed my check on ah <laughs> Yeah, that's quite the tripwire we almost walked over. I'm assuming that would just like set off these barrels. Um, let's just head back where we came from. That's lucky. I can't, I can't help it. You know, when I hear a, an accent like that, like that, mind you, let's not. Let's not uh, make things up. Dead Caravan Agent. You, that looks like a nice sword. What is that? Speedy Reply. Nimble attack when the wielder uh, hits an enemy with this weapon, they gain momentum. Oh, that's quite nice. Um, it's a scimitar and it has finesse. Interesting. Tempting. I mean, I'll definitely take it. Send this to wares. Pick up the rest. Good amount of food. I'm gonna save. I should do more saves. The game is not very good about saving. Um, I guess I was already over there, but it's interesting to see. Just a cliff like that. Chasm. Alright, where are we off to? I feel like that kind of checked a box there. So we've got the crash. Oh, meet with Rugen's associates. Is that not where the crush is? I guess the crush is here. So we should go over here. And check out Rugen's associates. We're going to be going northwest. Not sure. Is there something up here? It really feels like there should be. Oh, there's some Baslam. Oh, Bralsam. That's actually really good because it's um, for making healing potions. Nice. 
So we're back here. Um, I didn't expect to come back here so soon. I, I mean, oh, whatever. I didn't expect, I don't expect to come anywhere, really. I should really distribute some healing potions. I do kind of wish there was a button that was just like, distribute all the healing potions. Sweet key. That's um, missing shipment meet with Rugen's associates. Anything cool in here? Doesn't look like it. There's a haystack. That's a nice haystack. I like that haystack. We got a bunch of barrels over here. Always want to check out them barrels. This looks like it should go somewhere, but it, I don't think it does. Torch. That's in there. Oh, I think I forgot my candle. I was going to do something cool with that candle, but I... Oh, there we go. Dirt mound. Can't reach that. What do you mean you can't reach that? Rotten mushroom. I don't know if that, like, can you make poison with those? Oh, someone, someone buried their three cloves of garlic. Seems odd. Quite the mystery we have here. Yeah. Okay, what's going on over here? I have an ox friend. Well, they're not a friend anymore. This is the spot Rugen marked. Doesn't look like much. Okay. Oh, okay. There's quite a lot of stuff going on in here. Uh huh. You spot a man crouching between the shelves, just as he spots you. Bugger! Um, recite Rugen's pa past f phrase, Little Serpent Long Shadow. Oh, Helm's Orbs! I thought you were Flaming Fist. Oh, do you not like Down Flaming go, Fist? Then. They'll be on it soon, so if you're looking to trade, you best be quick. Oh, a traitor, huh? Entrance is hidden behind the wardrobe. Here's the key. Very nice. Now we can go back and steal the cargo. <laughs> Ooh, that's a nice hat. I like that hat. Wow, we got a lot of cool hats, actually. I must say, we've got quite the purveyor of hats. And another shovel. Well, that's like, I, I love a good a, a bit of irony, you know? Plate. Another shovel. Okay, bud. Calm down with these shovels. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I have to. I have to. There's all of these elven wood souls. Listen, some, some intern at Larian Studios had to go and place all of these crates and then put, like, some elven shoes in every single one of them. So, you know, far be it for me to appreciate... Uh, a bit of fine craftsmanship, you know? So what do we got? I know there's gonna be more. There's gonna be like a scroll or something. Oh, I'll, I'll grab those candles. Those will be worth what, worthwhile. There's the hatch to get to, to, I guess, the cellar. We can buy from Salazan though, right? You said you could pass, didn't I? Don't you have, uh, oh, never mind. Okay. He's very concentrate. He's concentrating on his task. I, you know, I appreciate that. I, I like a guy with good work work ethics. Okay, we're almost done here. I promise. Ruffleson Blackguard hat, huh? Okay. So what do we got down here? Zintarim basement. Well, we've got some wine. See, that one uh, wicker basket filled with wine justifies all of the empty crates that I look through. Ooh, look at that cheese. Oh, actually, we got some good stuff here. 
Got some fruit and some cheese and some wine. I'm gonna make a sandwich. It's okay. It's an adventure sandwich. It seems like um, someone broke their way in here already. Although they didn't seem to take any of the good stuff. Look at all this cool sausage we got. A cauldron. I am uh, like officially almost overweight here. We're just taking all the food, aren't we? Bronze keg? It seems like it would be worth something. No, it is not. Also, I didn't know you could examine items like that. Let's have a look at that again. Look, look at that. You, wow, you can like do the Skyrim them thing where you like look at every single model in this game. Astounding levels of work. Inroads by arms dealer Gortash. Seems simple enough. Here follows a report on the inroads upstart smuggler Enver Gortash has been making on the illicit arms trade in the uh, Chianthar Valley. Though inroads badly understates the case, annexation would be more apt. The former black market leaders, the Knights of the Shield, and outside the city. The Zentarium have largely been supplanted by Gortash's operation. Illegal arms have been uh, never been a major a component of the guild's business, but given his apparent ambitions, it would be unwise to assume that Gortash will stop there. He bears watching closely. Another engraved key. Some more food. I am now over encumbered. I'm going to have to send some of this stuff. I feel like I can send food back to camp. We've got grease bottles. Um, we've got tons of just like bottles. I don't know if we actually need any of these. I don't need that large bottle either. Throw it away. We don't need it. I was hoping it would shatter. Kind of disappointed, honestly. Camp supply sack jesus that's a lot of food um let's send that to carlac carlac's gonna be the official carrier of things you know of uh sorry camp supplies more food good lord what is i found several keys but nothing that those keys go into oh here we go wardrobe oh look at that, oh, look at that. oh there's a secret entrance in it i'm sorry there's just like so much food here i'm never gonna have to worry about food again not that i did in the first place but like it, it it fading into like cautious you know concern into uh you know never have to think about it again is kind of nice we've got a waypoint here like even more food good lord wow this place is quite extensive oh my god look at all those crates it's like the ending of uh raiders of the lost ark I'm just going to be here forever looting potatoes out of every single barrel and crate. It just won't stop. That's far enough. What's your business down here? Answer honestly and maybe we'll kill you clean. Wow. Isn't that the guy? Oh, that's the last who saved us yeah, from the Rugen. nulls. Let her in. You revealed our location. That tongue gets any looser, Rugen. I'll cut it out. Come down then. Seems you're a friend of the family. I oh, hope you don't mind uh, me, sweat. me taking all of your food. And? <laughs> yeah. Is that blood? No, never mind. Perception Can't failed, huh? I'm in danger. 
ceramic what is that grant granitic rock what is this is this like a, a trap sleight of hand huh hmm I'm not sure what that did Maybe I shouldn't have done that, but I'm saving. I'm living with that weight, soldier. We've got another one. Trap. Be cautious. What's that smell? That's curious. Oh, what's that? Oh, I guess I'm, I'm guessing that that sets off those traps. Tell her it's a gambling desk. It's happened before. Very well. So what do we got going on here? Well, don't you cut a fine figure? Want your portrait done? Sure. If you have the gold, my pet artist will make you a most heroical likeness. You have a pet artist? Let's say we're his patrons. Yeah. Found him wandering the wilds alone. He needs protection. And if his paintings cover our costs, so much the better. This better uh, not be Volo, I swear to God. Protection, it sounds a bit more like kidnapping. Are you looking to buy him? I'm open to offers, mate. Threats, not so much. Uh, if he's as talented as you say, someone will be looking for him. And plus two from favorable beginnings, plus 1d4 from guidance. Oh, and we have... Uh, Advantage on this. Art's more valuable once the creator is dead. I can arrange that. <laughs> Amazing. Ooh, we just barely made it. What? Kill him and the price of his drawings goes up? Bloody clever, that. Go on, then. But don't kill him here. He's going to be a bleater. I know it. I don't I'm not actually gonna kill him don't worry you don't want to keep Zaris waiting believe me uh pick up the pace I can't say I've ever been bought before how much did I fetch no don't tell me there's nothing so depressing as learning one's true value. <laughs> well, you should at least know what you've paid for. I am the Oscar Fevras, at your service. I've never heard of you. An affliction for which you cannot be faulted, this far from civilization. But my patron will be most grateful for your heroics. My betrothed, I should say. Assuming Lady Janeth still wishes to marry me after our little, um, falling out. What happened? She offered me a future. And so, in a fit of madness, I told her of my past. Of the woman I loved before she found me. Love still, in truth. She was less than pleased. I made a timely retreat into the countryside to paint and clear my head. To choose, I suppose. Truly horrifying dilemma. Indeed. One to split the very soul. But I dare not dwell on it any longer lest I weep. Okay. And we have your reward to consider once I have made my way safely back to the city. Say, you, I don't suppose you could spare some coin, could you? Ease the discomforts of the road some. I can spare a little. I'll give you a serious discomfort to deal with if you don't get going now. Right you are. Just asking for a little help, was all. Until Boulder's Gate, then. So, have I, like convinced Brem that I'm going to kill him and then let him go? Is is that what happened just now? Because I am a little bit confused. Lamps, lads. See you, Don't want open flames where we're going. 
Um, let's have a look at, let's talk to Beller over here. Hoping one of these guys is actually, oh, I guess Brem. Brem is actually a merchant. You seem a nice soul. I'm glad we didn't have to kill ya. You. you guys seem real charming. You do a better job than that ponce you saw. <laughs> Keep it up, little brother. Might be I can sell you someday. Maybe curious is Something the... Something I can help you with. I want to trade. Fancy that. So do I. Okay, let's... Um. Oh, he only sells dyes. Okay. It's a little bit disappointing. Well, let's um, sell our trade goods at the very least. He does have some money. Um, let's go to trade. Sell wares. Has insufficient gold to complete the transaction. That's fine. Let's get like partially the way there. Sell like the heavy stuff first. Um, some bucklers. Still not sure if I want to um, keep some of those, like one of those bucklers. Sell some books. This warboard. Nature's snare. Okay, they're they're spent. Well, we can sell like boots and gloves and rings and crap like this. Okay. That's quite a lot of money we just made there. I can't show you the good stuff till Zaris gives the say so mind. Friends of the Zen only. Oh. Okay, well, let's talk to Zaris then. Are we unpacking? I thought we was packing. I owe you one for saving my people. The Zentarim look out for their own. Even if it's Rugen. That's worth some coin. Oh, hey, thanks. And my thanks. Our trader can show you some of our more exotic items now. But don't delay. This place is likely to be rubble soon. Cool, he's got some good, good stuff now. Rubble, what are you planning to do? Someone kidnapped a duke. Right on our bloody doorstep. The Flaming Fist will need someone to blame. I don't plan on it being us. Found a herald. Not proficient with martial weapons or heavy crossbows. Heraldish doom. When you deal damage to a target with a ranged weapon, it must succeed a charisma saving throw or to or be baned for two turns. That seems really good. Like worth taking martial proficiency, maybe. Um, not gonna explore the deeper parts of this cave just yet. Instead, I'm gonna go and check out the, um, Brem's goods. Something I can help you with? Yeah, yeah. Show me the good stuff. Okay, Mr. Got some interesting stuff for a friend Thank you, Carr. Okay. Uh, scale mail. This is medium armor. We can take that. Um, I do think I made Karlak proficient with medium armor. Yeah, she is, she is proficient with medium armor at the very least. Might be worth buying some better armor. Um, we got a short sword plus one, which is nice. Light. Uh, we could potentially use that instead of one of our daggers. Like we could be rolling with an assassin's touch dag dagger and a short sword. I kind of like our setup right now, though. Longbow plus one. That seems kind of nice. I don't think anyone can use it is the only problem. Let me see. And oh, uh, well, Lazelle can. She can use a longbow. And surprisingly, so can Karlak. We've got a scimitar. Scimitars are kind of a problem. Um, they need proficiency again. Chain shirt is medium armor? I thought it was large armor or something. Um, AC bonus from dexterity limited to plus two. 
You take one less from slashing damage. Disadvantage on stealth checks. Okay, so Carlac wouldn't be able to stealth, but that's okay. She's not going to in the first place. Oh, it's chain mail that's heavy armor. Ring mail is also heavy armor. Good to know. The Whispering Promise. You blood, and when you heal a creature, you gain a plus 1d4 bonus to attack rolls and saving throws for two turns. We definitely want that. Um, and also, he's got more money now, so he can probably sell wares. Although, honestly, let's like, we could probably do a bit of bar bartering. Uh, yeah, that. And some of these special items as well. Yeah, we're gonna sell the Great X. Sucks, but, um, you know, that's that's the price of, like, changing your class and stuff like that. So we're gonna buy this Whispering Promise. Jolty Vest. You take one less slashing damage. When the wearer takes damage while having lightning charges, the attacker must succeed a dexterity saving throw. I kind of want this because I'm pretty sure someone's already wearing Jolty Boots. Gloves of Thievery. Advantage on sleight of hand checks. I'm pretty sure Tav has already got something like that on him, but that would be kind of nice. Rupturing Blade has finesse. Um, hmm. Oh, it's a rapier. Rapier? Rapier? Um, I do want some scale mail. Gloves of Hail of Thorns. It just gives us Hail of Thorns. Um, let's go ahead and pick up the scale mail plus one. Oh, we're already, like, pretty spent. Is there anything else cool I'd like? Gain advantage on dexterity saving throws and checks. I kind of want these Gloves of Thievery. I'm going to go ahead and pick those up as well. We don't have enough money. Um, no. Okay, so let's um take off that. Oh, what? I guess I did have enough. I like these are good scrolls, so I don't really want to take those off. Um, I'm gonna give him. No, uh, we're we're good. Barter, go for it. Pleasure. I'm gonna just double check. Oh, we've got blo gloves of power on a melee hit, possibly inflict a one d negative one d four penalty to the attack targets attacking rolls. And then he's got the water sparks. That's what it is. Um, I would kind of like to give that to someone else and then double down on this. Maybe Shadowheart would be good for that. She's got the speedy le uh, light feet. Oh, that, that gives her lightning charges already. So yeah, she's already got that going on. So she would be perfect for Jolty Vest. She can also wear medium armor. She's great. She's gonna she's gonna be very jolty. And we're gonna give her whispering promise. Um and scale mail, I think should go to Carlac. Yeah. Anyone for padded armor? I don't think so. We'll probably end up selling those. I'm also gonna put some of our stuff in our yeah Harold. We're gonna we're gonna become proficient in that. Uh, is there anything else? Ring of color spray. Someone should use that. Brutes of striding. Someone should wear this. Oh, it's medium armor. Oh, she Carla can wear that now. Reasons Grasp. Can she wear these? She can, but I really like these gloves. They're just very good. Um, gloves of Gro Growling Underdog is actually very good for Lazel. Although maybe, I don't know. Um, uh, Reasons Grasp is just really nice. Specifically for the Barbarian. 
Tell you what though, gloves of missile snaring wouldn't be terrible for Shadow Heart, so there you go. And I'm gonna start throwing some of these weapons and items on Lazel for safekeeping slash, you know, we're gonna sell them later. I know there's an easy way, easier way to do this, but whatever. Everyone's looking pretty good. We've got we've got pretty good gear going on. Um Lazel doesn't have a helmet and hasn't for a while. But I guess helmets don't actually provide a AC, they just provide an extra spell. So never mind. Alright, we're we're good. Someday. Oh. Like Ma always wanted. Okay, um so we're good in that regard. We'll explore the rest of the cave now. You're a friend of the Zents now. That's worth something in Baldur's Gate. Oh, yeah? Assuming we make it back there in one piece. No one stopped me yet. Let's talk to Rugen real quick. That drink I promised will have to wait. We're moving out. The Elf Song's my local. Look me up if you're in the city. Okay. I have something to ask. Good to see you. Killed any more beasts out there? No, not really. I'm ready. What's hiding here? It's so funny that some of these count as stealing and others do not. I guess they don't care if I take their food, but they might care if I take something from here. I'm not going to chance it. The approachable east. Oh, look at all the food. Good lord. I'm gonna take this baguette and this potato porridge. And these green grapes. It's all mine. All the food is mine. I am assuming that this way is gonna be fairly dangerous. Someone down there. Carad. I do want to kind of check out what's going on over here. Oh, there's a wolf. Good lad or bad lad? Where are we going? Um, excuse me? What? Why are we doing it this way? I, I mean, I don't care whatever way is more comfortable for you, I guess. Oh. Okay. Everyone's frightened of something. My fear is hardly irrational when you see the fangs in those things. Interesting. I suppose you've noticed I'm not terribly fond of wolves. They're ravenous predators with fangs like daggers. It's hardly an irrational fear to harbor. You've been decent to me so far. Maybe if you can, don't make me face any more of them. At least, not alone. Okay. I'll try to avoid wolves in the future where possible. Thank you. I had a feeling you'd be understanding. That artifact seems to be protecting us somehow. Do you still have it? Uh, you seemed intrigued when Halson mentioned Dark Judiciers before. I was. He mentioned Dark Justiciers, and we've come across other signs of a Sharon presence during our travels. I'm not sure I can dismiss that as a coincidence. Why well, I uh, want to talk about your Shar worship. I want to talk about all that's happened to us. Fine. What's on your mind? How am I holding up in your estimations? What do you think about what happened to the Druid Grove? I suppose some would commend our actions. Goblins would have raised that whole place to nothing if it weren't for us. True. No excuse to rest on our laurels, though. We've still got our own problems to contend with. All of that true. Um. Uh, want to talk about your Shar worship? I want to. These illicit powers were developing. On one hand, they seem useful. But on the other hand, or perhaps tentacle before long, we know where they're coming from and what lies at the end of that path. 
I never expected Ceramorphosis to be tempting. I think we should resist these powers. There's simply too many unknowns for us to risk it. Okay. The odds are stacked against us. Can we truly afford to ignore a potential advantage? <laughs> I was gonna say, if she gives me guidance against the check I'm making against her... Oh, is that a critical failure? Okay. Oh, uh, roll again. Why not? Okay, I'm gonna live with this. I see it as more a case of wisely avoiding a potential threat. My mind is set. All right, she's not down for uh, for any of that. I talked to GR. I know she doesn't want to do the wolves. Peach, a shot on you as you came in. Okay. Well, I'm not sure what's in that direction. But let's not go near the wolves. Hmm. All right. What now? Anything? Uh, okay, it all just kind of loops around. Okay, well, let's, um, I think we kind of did what we wanted to accomplish down here. We talked to the trader, we talked to, you know, we accomplished something. Let's leave. Find the Githyanki patrol, reach the mountain pass, travel through the temple of Salune. These are fairly, um, tall asks, all of them. So I'd rather do some more exploration of the wilderness before we move on to some of the more story-based stuff. Better not be good. That ladder better not be cursed. It's a, it's a ladder. It's a shoddily made one at that. I hope it's not cursed. Oh, this ladder seems to be sapping my strength. No, you're just really weak. You're you're malnourished, dude. You just keep eating sausage. Oh, it's good protein. You need you need you to eat your grapes, dude. Um, all right. Well, we're out of here. Where else can we go? We could go to the mountain pass. I feel like that's going to be more of the same. Travel through the underdark. We can't really do that. There's more over here that we haven't really explored. So let's go over there. Let's check out south. I've checked out north and northwest. These goblins aren't exactly house-proud as occupiers go. Let's go south. Southwest. Oh, we can just go south from the Blighted Village. We haven't yeah, really gone like in trash. this direction. Scare off a few dusty bottles of wine somewhere. Looking. I like your way of thinking. Split any takings we find? Sister, you've got a deal. I don't know. I missed what they, the... the the cross character banter, I'm afraid. I'm assuming it was all wholesome and nothing to worry about. We know you have her. Please, we just want Marina back. Lads, for the love of all that is holy, I've never clapped eyes on your poor sister. Drop the act, hag. You was the last to see Marina. Just let her go. Please. You there? Please, I don't know what's come over these boys. I just want to go home. Stop this. We we won't ask again. Save failed. Um, how about you just calm down? What's going on here? Careful. Don't trust a word out of her mouth. Our sister went to the hag, and we ain't seen her since. Hand over heart, I don't know their sister. I will gladly help you all look for her, though. Enough. Where is she? Hmm. Tell the truth. What did you do to their sister? Bollocks. Carlock approves. You were supposed to rush to my defense, love. Fat lot of good you are. Some advice. 
You ever darken my door, you'd best have that head bowed and an apology at the ready. Bye bye now. Bloody hells. She just disappeared. Ain't seen nothing like that before. She could shoot fireworks out of her backside for all I care. The hag has bring her. Someone please tell me what's going on. It's our sister, Marina. She's... Well... She was in a bad way after her husband died. Started saying weird things, like how she was gonna bring him back. Next thing, she's gone looking for the hag. Of all the stupid things to do. And we haven't seen her since. And no good ever came from dealing with a hag. None of this matters, all right? We need to get her back, and fast! Uh, let me. I'll bring Marin Marina home. Are you joking? I ain't got a clue who you are. No way I'm leaving Rena to you. Why but does Shadowheart Joe, disapprove? Not a chance. We're getting her back on our own. Now, come on. I'm not sure I understand that one. In a way, that's kind of why I like Shadowheart. Is she doesn't seem to be just like a purely, um, you know, virtuous. A chill runs up your spine. You feel like you're being watched. Look for anything out of the ordinary. 20. Oof, that's not going to do it. I'll roll that again. Exactly once more. Okay. We're just going to live with this feeling. The place has a quiet sense of calm. You can't see anything strange. Loving note. Take a breather, lovelies, and have a bite to eat on me, Auntie E. Oh, yeah? Yeah, sure. I'll just take apples from hags. Why not? Don't necessarily subscribe to the idea that she's a hag. Hot foot, hot foot. Place is trapped. Spike trap, huh? Just one step at a time. At the very least, if we fail a check, we know not to go that way. Huh. Humans. What do they expect? Whoever did this wanted them to suffer. We need to be careful. Karlak. Go ahead and uh, tell us, tell us some stuff. The corpse regards you lifelessly. Um, what killed you? <gasps> Wasn't a sheep. Um, did you find your sister? Heard <gasps> her screaming, but not real. Um, this place seems strange. Anything I should be wary of? Don't drink the water. Uh, why come here? <gasps> Gotta get Marina back for man. I think I get like one more. Who are you? Uh, where are you from? Farm out by Baldur's Gate. The spell's power wanes. You can ask no more questions. Okay. Ah, we got a waypoint. This is, uh... This might get spicy. I don't know. What was that? 
I just heard something. Like, I don't want to be on bad terms with the hag. Don't drink the water. Okay. I'll just go and apologize to her. Honestly. What do we have here? Looking ahead. How much farther can I go? I don't want a crumb left on that plate, girl. Auntie Ethel, please. One more bite and this pie is going to come back up to say hello. Don't make me get the wooden spoon. You're eating for two, so get to it. If it isn't the cheekiest pop of them all, you best have one hells of an apology for me, young man. Well, I mean, it seems like you have the girl. Attack her. Um, you must have mistaken me for someone else. I don't think I did, dearie. And frankly, you're a thick for saying so. You know, I was going to give you a swift kick up the arse and show you the door. But I think you and I could have a bit of fun together. Gods grant me patience. Eat up, Marina. I won't say it again. Um, that's Marina. I have some bad news for her. Keep that hole under your nose shut, or things will get messy. Don't bother. You'd only subject us to her inevitable wailing. Hmm. What is it? What's going on? Nothing. I mistook you for someone else. You just have one of those faces, Marina. So bland and forgettable. Wow. Smart move, sweetness. Now, I can tell you're in dire need of help, Petal. That wriggler swimming in your brain juice is a bit of an inconvenience, isn't it? How do you know that? Because you stink. And I know the stench of mind flare anywhere. I can tell you're almost done cooking. You know, you could turn just like that. What do you say? Want me to take care of the little bugger? Depends on the price. Well, that depends on the job. A removing a parasite is no small feat. But I like you, Petal. So I'll only ask for something small. What's that? One of your pretty little peepers. I've already lost oh one. You don't have one to spare. Terribly sorry, Petal. But no deal for you. Should you know someone with two eyes in their head and a regular problem? Send them my way. Auntie will sort them out. Uh, any, any takers? Come now, Marina. Time to go. I feel like the only one... What? I feel like the only one that would maybe take that um, would be Lazelle, but she wouldn't because she's like, well, my crush will just help me. Right? So, do you Hello, buy sweetness. stuff? I'm still waiting for someone with a spare eye. What happened to Marina? Did you do something to her? Keep your own little nose in your own little dish, Petal. I don't like busybodies. I'm here to trade. What you got? Um, let's trade is barter. It's, it's, you know. Sell wares. What she got? She got some. Ooh, she's got some plants. Potion of invisibility. Some uh, potions of healing. Elixir of giant hill giant strength. Yeah. Here for whatever you need, Petal. I don't know who would take that that deal. I don't think Shadowheart would. I don't know. I wonder what Do you think she would take that deal? Carlac? I don't know. No time to She'd be, I feel like Carlac would be more likely to take, uh, use the, the, the worm's powers. Uh, 
I don't trust this this woman. I mean, it's very easy not to trust her, to be honest. Hello, sweetness. I'm still waiting for someone with a spare eye. Keep your own little nose. I don't like busybodies. Ta-ta, Petal. Come see Auntie soon. Yeah, I mean, I, I really don't know what's up here, but I'm 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 actually gonna leave it alone. I need more pockets. I'm just standing don't in the forge, huh? There does seem to be something behind there. Oh, I curse to put my hands on everything. Tons of uh, good alchemy goodness in here. Oh, and a wooden chest. I mean, I may as well check it out. Attention right now. Sure. Is that gilded mortar and pestle? Is that worth anything? Nope. Some nice things in here. So I guess I'm not gonna fight her, but I am gonna rob the old woman blind. Ooh, a butter bun. Treehouse key, huh? Yeah, I mean, that seems pressing. I wonder where that goes. I'm assuming there's a treehouse outside somewhere. There's a thief on the loose. Uh oh. Goodbye. <laughs> Goodbye. What's this quest here? Get Auntie Ethel's help. Oh. The game wants me to trade my eye. Moving in. Okay, let's see if we can find a uh, a place where this keyhole goes. That seems like something over there. Let's check that out. I don't know how to get there. Seems like we can get there from here, maybe? Oh, I have to go that way. Okay. I'm gonna get caught, aren't I? Just out of view. Breathe deep and move. Okay, she's she's over there. I'm fine. I'm fine. There's a door. I'm 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 totally fine. Cast to put my hands on everything. We're good. Actually, let's close that just so she doesn't get suspicious. Arcane barrier. Who can deal with this? Probably Shadowheart, maybe. What's next? I wonder. Things. Climb on. Okay, um. Sometimes. Nothing in the vase. That looks like a coffin. I don't really know what, what I'm doing. I feel like I am gonna just have to kill that old hag. But I have a horrible feeling she's going to be tough. Check out over here. Check out the wicker basket, you know? I guess I didn't need to go through that door. I bet you there's, there's going to be an alternative way to get here. Oh, a rotten tomato. Can never have too many of those. 
Hands off pedal was a condition. Doesn't seem to be anything over here. Wow, really? I didn't expect there to be nothing over here. Probably there's a story event that goes in that direction. Do here can we attack it i wonder i could go for a good meal poor fucker that does not seem effective Okay, well, um, none of that seems to be accomplishing anything. Um, I'm gonna have Lazil take the deal. She might take it even even though her crush is around the corner. We must speak. Hello, sweetness. You going to give me one of those precious peepers? Will my sight be damaged? A touch, but sure you've two eyes in your skull, don't you? No need to be precious. You want one of my eyes, why? I'm afraid that's my business, Petal. It's nothing nefarious, though. I promise. Sure. Glorious. One moment, and she needs her real nails for this. Okay. Jesus. You blink and the wilderness changes. A swamp, stinking and insidious, assaults your senses. Much better. That human skin is fierce, restrictive. What in the spinning planes are you? Close that mouth, precious. Let's just swallow a fly. Not many get to see a hag in all her glory. Consider yourself blessed. Now choose which eye will it be, right or left? Attack. You absolute idiot. Not down. <laughs> they are invisible, but, but I can see vis invisible creatures in theory, right? Within 30 feet is seen, but we know they're there. Um, red cap. Okay. This is some Fabius. Uh, why don't we go ahead and just throw down some fire right there? Just right there. You know, not for any reason. Victory awaits. Um. It didn't. It didn't actually work the way I'd hoped. Is it not? Is she not right there? Okay. Well, this might be a bit more of a problem than I thought. No time to waste. A go 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 be. Do 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 do. Fuck all this. All right. Me on the go. Let's um. Let's just hold tight for a moment. Actually, I'm gonna have her 
Carla, like, drink a potion. Um, what do we need to do for these? Take one less slashing damage. When the wearer takes damage while having lightning charges, the attacker must succeed a dexterity saving throw or become shocked. Dashes or take a similar... Okay, so she needs to dash. I'm just gonna go here so she's got a bit of range. Just dashing so that she builds up some charges. Red cap. Oh god. Oh, they have a lot of health. Yeah, they got they have a lot of health. I might not be ready for this. Where is she? Enjoy playing with your new friend. I can't have gone far. Okay, so we're just fighting these guys for now. I'm actually totally cool with that. Um, let's do a blink like right there, maybe. Not sure. They, oh, they have like kind of vision over the whole thing. Let's go there. And then hide. And then can we sneak attack? Yes, we can. Cut into the chase. Very nice. We should probably put some toxins on our weapon. Okay, Lazel is down. Um, this is an action, unfortunately. So I'm just gonna wait for Shadowheart's turn because she gets a benefit from healing anyway, and she can also do it as a bonus action. Um, we are going to go into frenzy mode now. Do we have cleave? We do. It doesn't very, it doesn't do a lot of damage. I feel like it'd be better to just do something like with a bit of oomph. Maiming strike. We can't move. I don't think that matters too much. Let's do like a lacerate. We'll have to make it a reckless attack. Okay. Um, oh, I don't have any spells. Oh, that's really bad. I should have done a long rest a while ago. And he got his attack of opportunity. We're going to have to just help up Lazel. That still counts as healing though, right? So we get a benefit maybe? I don't think so, somehow. Uh, plus one D4 bonus to attack rolls. Blessed Mercy. I feel like it would say something. Do these lightning charges disappear each round? Let me have a quick look at this. If plus one to attack rolls and deal an additional one da lightning damage, you, if you gain five charges, they are consumed the next time you deal damage. And you deal an additional 1d 1 to 8 lightning damage you lose one charge per round yeah so we have to we have to continuously gain them i feel like there's there's got to be a better way to gain them but um this is not it we're gonna have to take a healing potion lazel gets a turn maybe she can get a lucky oh she gets a uh, advantage nice perfect um does she have any healing? Oh, she doesn't have any healing potions. She's gonna die for sure. A little help, please. Shadowheart is almost dead. Oh, this is all pretty bad. Let's do um, simple talks. I wonder if they have dark vision. Because I could do like a, a thing of darkness. I'm just thinking. Could do something like this. That's an actual action though, so I don't think that'll be good. 
Just try and kill someone. I guess I can't hit this guy unless I get down, so I'm gonna have to try and kill this guy. What do I have to lose? Only 13 damage. Uh, potion of speed, potion of accuracy. Should have taken my toxin. I didn't take my toxin. I'll take it now. I don't need any attention right now. So I'm pretty sure I just bungled my hide attempt. Lazel is down. Luckily, Carlax still in this. We'll do a frenzied attack. Um, Shadow Heart is still alive, so she gets a turn. Sixty-five versus seventy. We do something else. Reckless attack. Maybe a goading attack. Gains disadvantage on attack rolls against anyone but you. Let's do that. Very good. Can we throw these guys? We have disadvantage. But we can certainly try. Target is too close. We succeeded. We threw them and did some damage. Nice. Um, okay, we do have a healing. It's Saluna's dream. Let's use that. She might sleep she saved against it so that's good um don't know what else we have we can dip our weapon in something do i have a candle on me no i don't okay second wind extra action to use this turn let's do that and do a lacerate nice where's what is the hag doing oh he, this guy is all the way over here where is this guy this is a completely unrelated lad i feel Can we we can shoot that lad so we would actually be a good it would be a good idea to hide and then do a sneak attack why can we not hit him now okay well whatever cool um potion of feather falling antidote glorious vaulting just wondering if um there's anything else i could throw down right now We're not in sight right now. I'm just going to hide. Everyone else minds their business. I'll be fine. Yeah. My injuries need tending. Okay. Lazel is almost dead. Very nearly dead. Um. She is bleeding. Two damage per turn. We just kind of... I think we honestly have to go for it. Tell you what, I'll do Astral Knowledge Constitution. Uh, do we... Oh, I guess Constitution isn't something we can do. Okay, <laughs> never mind. Um, we'll just do a main hand attack. 70%, come on. Cool. Can we do a pommel attack? Doesn't look like it. Where's our pommel? Oh, we need to do a short rest. It's a short rest thing. This is gonna feel good. I've got it. Maiming strike, not maiming strike, sorry. Frenzied strike. Sure, make it a reckless attack. Very good. And go over here and start hitting this guy. Can we throw them actually? Uh, it doesn't look like it. So we'll just do a normal attack. Unless we have something better, I don't think we do. Advantage. Nice. And I'm really hoping that he doesn't decide to walk past me, although he does have ranged abilities. 
this is once per long rest, so we can't unfortunately do anything for Lazel. She's gonna die on the next turn. We used a lightning charge on that. That's fine. So this guy is making his way over here. Slowly but surely. If we come over here, we should be able to do um, another sneak attack on this guy. Very nice. Um... I don't know if there's much else we can or should do. So I'm just going to leave him there and go back into hiding. Old person on Karlak. I mean, that's fine. It's not going to do any harm to her. Oh, Karlak. Actually, that's not good. Um, Shadow Heart will heal or help Lazel. Sorry, I can't do better than that right now. We don't have a bonus action to spare we don't have any spells we have nothing honestly feel like backing up might be a good idea Onward. Time to strike. yeah let's let's back up it's not a great idea because they can they totally have the upper hand they have ranged abilities and they also have a friend coming so that's not good This is turning into a long episode. Fortunately, this lad over here is looking in the other direction. Can we... We can hit him from there. Okay, so let's go there. And do a sneak attack on him. Path is interrupted. I don't understand. I am I, I'm, I'm so often confused, you know? How come we can't hit him? We can hit him with a ranged attack, but we can't hit him with a... S there we go. I think. Path is interrupted. I don't understand. Why is the path interrupted now, but not when I do a normal ranged attack? 60 feet. You can also use this attack if you have an ally within 5 feet of the target and you don't have disadvantage. That's actually good to know. I didn't know that part. I mean, I probably did know that part, but um, either way, this this doesn't make any sense to me. Whatever. He's almost dead. He's dead. It's cool. Rage ended. Oh yeah, Carla couldn't do her turn, so her rage ended. Uh, that is unfortunate. It's okay. We can use. We have one one more rage. We can we can use it at the uh, end of this combat. I don't know what to do, honestly. Taking position. Carlac is well. She's actually doing okay. We can just wait for this guy to come to us. How far away is he? Oh, he's not too bad. Let's finish this. Um. Heading there. Okay. I don't know. He's dashing over. This is good. Wow, they really can't move that far. I'm assuming we can't hit him from there? No. Um, I'm wondering if it would be better to move over here. I'm going to do a dash. And try and head over here. And I should be able to hit him on my next turn. And I'll, I'll push, uh, push out with some of the melee users. Uh, maybe not Lazel. Maybe just Karlak. So we'll push out like here. Close ranks. Good. Hopefully that does not kill her. Shadowheart's almost dead, so she's just gonna stay where she is. Yeah, that, that's fine. He he had to waste a spell on that. So then I'm pretty sure uh, they might be out of range, actually. Swift as my feet can carry me. <laughs> She's just barely out of range. We have 95% chance of hitting him somehow. Works for me. Softer than a whisper. 
Okay, we're just gonna engage him with uh, Karlak. Need to learn the hard way. <laughs> nice. Ready. So he gets to do one more thing on Karlak. She saved against it. He's gonna jump past her. Done. Right. Time to skulk about. Okay. So I'm guessing we have a secret door here that we can now see. I feel like I could have done this before. Can we like jump in there? Yeah, we totally can. Okay, we'll do that on the next episode. Um, if you are enjoying this series, definitely hit that like button and consider subscribing for more content like this. And look at all that gold I just got. Isn't that nice? And I'll see you guys next time. Take it easy.